Welcome Loyalty Squad, this is the Velvet Locks coming back to you in the kitchen with another video. Hello Velvet? Yes? I need your help. Welcome Loyalty Squad, this is the Velvet Knox back again with another video. Now, before I get into the video, I just want to wish everybody a Merry Christmas, a Happy New Year, because I've been gone MIA for quite some time. And basically, it's just life. Life has been happening for your girl, okay? I think I'm going to make a separate life update video. So I'm going to post that on my other channel, but for this channel, I wanted to come on you posting more weight loss videos if that's what you guys still want, okay? Now, I know that this channel is basically a healthy lifestyle living channel. It's a channel that encourages you to live healthier, encourages you to lose weight, detox your body, boost your immune system, all of that good stuff. Well. As you can see all around you that's going on in this world, things have gotten really ridiculous. It's gotten crazy, it's gotten scary, and it doesn't seem like it's getting any better. Yeah, turned on the light, okay, a little bit better. And it doesn't seem like it's gonna get any better for this country. I don't wanna come on here with the humdrum type of vibe, a scariness, you know, anything that's gonna make you worry or boost up your anxiety. But in one of my last videos before Vlogmas took place, I was encouraging you guys to really start thinking about getting yourself ready because so much is taking place, so much is getting ready to happen, and I'm getting my family together, getting my homestead you know, together. And I wanna encourage you all to do the same. I wanted to show you how I plan on building up a pantry, actually. Something that you can stock up in your home and prepare yourself for any type of mishap. So sorry about that, you guys. I got interrupted with the phone, but I just wanted to encourage you guys, basically, to you know start a pantry, a emergency pantry for your home, start building it up with supplies, with food, with the essentials. Because, as you can see, if you're in the supermarkets often, like I am, you're gonna start to notice a lot of emptiness. You're gonna start to notice, if you haven't already, start to see a lot of lack in produce, in meats, in juices, in everything. The other day I was in the supermarket, I know it was after Christmas, but seeing the shortages around in the area it, it is a little depressing it's scary it really is stepping into some of these supermarkets i'm noticing it may look as though it's stocked when you walk through the aisles you'll see the products on the shelves all the way to the tip of the shelves and you're looking and it's like nah everything looks good in here but take a box or a can off that shelf that's when you're going to start to notice there's emptiness behind the shelf. And what the supermarkets are doing now is not to make you think that there's a problem, but mm -mm 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 -mm. it's a false way of making you think that their supply is strong when it's not. It really is not strong at all. There's a lot of lack on the shelves. There's a lot of empty spaces on the shelves. There's a lot of products that they're not even able to get anymore they haven't gotten shipment of and this is the time for you guys to start stocking up before it gets any worse before a storm or something hits where everybody rushes out and then starts to get their their food supply but I encourage every last one of you to start an emergency pantry in your home in your apartment wherever something that you can live off of for a lengthy time when you think about it depending on the size of your family because there's a lot of prices that's getting ready to go up this year on everything. I mean, everything. 
I was just listening to the news this morning and they were talking about gas prices and I don't even remember, remember what state it was that they are protesting right now. But if you turn on your news and you talk about gas prices, you, you know, check out gas prices, or if you Google protesting, in this particular state, they've doubled or tripled the price for gas. They've tripled or doubled the amount. So they're out there outraged and protesting. Not to mention, they were, they're talking on the news channel about how our meats are going to be going up the amount, our food supplies are going to be going up, and some places probably more because this is the time where people tend to get even more greedier. You know, these little franchises want to boost up their prices. So our normal everyday things that we eat either are not going to be available anymore because they're no longer going to be able to get it or they're going to be boosting up the prices of the things that they do have. That goes across the line for produce, meats, forget about it. You're not going to get the same, but stock up on your canned goods, stock up on your paper goods, stock up on your you know everyday uh, essentials, stock up even on your pharmaceutical goods, your medications, your cough medicines, your vitamins, okay, because you're going to need to continue boosting up your body. Now, I have a video that I made a while ago regarding boosting your immune system. That is something that you're going to have to start doing if you haven't already. But listen, y'all, this is a time that really we have to be more conscious-minded and not get distracted from all the things that they're putting before us. I was watching YouTube the other day, other, other content creator channels, and... It just seems to me that so many people are far from reality. <laughs> what disturbed me the most was watching the mukbang community. And this one particular mukbanger named Nikocado Avocado. Now, I have nothing against this gentleman. I watched him a few times and he was very entertaining, but it's really sad and sickening to see somebody and even in that community, gouge and eat and eat and eat and waste food. And we're going through shortages. But that's a big sin right there. That's gluttony. I'm sorry. I know I may get some hate on this video. I'm sorry. It's not meant to bash any type of channel and what you do on your platform. But in this day and age that we're living in right now, it just seems wasteful unnecessary because there's so many people that won't be able to afford food they won't be able to afford a place to live they won't even be able to afford to put gas in their cars you guys got to really start opening your eyes to see what is really going on around i just basically wanted to start this year off with an encouraging video something that is more about what's going on now and talking more about the things that I've seen in my experiences. Just being here as well as the things that I've seen other content creators who are talking about these things and just basically facts. So if you want to see more content like this, please let me know down below because the more you stay woke and focus on your family, on providing for them, building up your resources, putting things aside for emergencies and I don't mean just for a few days I mean putting stuff aside for emergencies starting to learn how to grow vegetables and fruits in your home as well as if you have a, a, a big enough yard or a garden a patio or whatever that you can actually do that in the summer you can plant that outside because you're really gonna have to start thinking about you and surviving in this uncertain time that we're living in because it really is uncertain right now things may seem like it's moving smoothly it's not it really is not it's it's really scary and it's alarming so it's time for you now to start thinking about your health getting it healthy really and truly losing all that excess weight is a part of gaining your health and getting it in a better way of, of surviving eating properly nourishment nutrition vitamins supplements so please, I want you all to let me know what it is you want me to start showing on this channel regarding that. 
if you want more weight loss tea videos, I'll continue doing that because that is a part of losing that toxic waste and being healthier. But I also want to show you some of the things that I've started doing to try to survive so any type of emergency situations. Not to mention stocking up on certain uh, resources in case we do have an outage. You have electrical cooking because we have electric stove now and if we have an outage I'm not able to use that. You just got to be ready. You really got to be ready. So I just want to end this video encouraging words to you guys to really start opening your eyes, staying focused, and visit your local supermarkets. Even take a trip to several of them, even your Walmarts. Look around and see the shelves. Take a product off the shelf and look behind it. You're gonna see that there's a lot missing. Even in other parts of the world, they're being told to start stocking up. Like in China, they were instructed to start stocking up. And that's something that you guys need to start doing too. We all need to start focusing on the reality of what's going on, start preparing our household, preparing ourselves, getting resources and things available and in your home ready for emergency situations and outages so that you can still survive through the cold. You can still heat your house or you can still heat your room. If you're able and able to afford generators, purchase those. But you're going to need gas to supply that if, if you don't have a solar generator. But there's a lot of things, you guys, that really got me thinking a lot. And I've been very distracted with this channel, trying to build up for my home. We just moved here in August, and I've been decorating. I've even purchased another vehicle. So I've been very busy, very busy. I've been working like crazy, doing my other supplements and income work. And I've just been really busy. But during my busyness, I've been out and about and able to see a lot of things that's taken place, not to mention researching and watching news channels throughout the whole entire country and also Googling certain things and seeing different things that's going on all around the world. So just know that this pandemic probably isn't leaving us for a while. So it's time for you to really start boosting up your immunity. I'm gonna upload another video regarding how you can boost your immunity and how to stay safe. If you do get this situation, you're able to fight it because you are much stronger in your immunity, okay? This is what kept me and my family safe so far throughout this whole entire fiasco that from the beginning till now, all of us have been good and we haven't taken the job. None of us have. That's a personal choice and preference on me as well as my family and what we've been doing to keep ourselves healthy. And it all starts with what you eat and boosting up your body, okay? So if you want to see videos on that, let me know down below. I'll have them out for you. And I'm going to really try to split my time, which has been very busy these days, into making more videos or so keeping you in tuned on things to keep on top of as well as losing weight so down below in the comment section let me know what you want to see more of if you want me to start showing you more videos on how to prepare your pantry how to prepare say like heating for your home cooking in case of you will not be without and even if you lose electricity in this cold season you can still refrigerate your stuff that's the best part about the cold part. You can still refrigerate and won't spoil your frozen goods. But just keep in mind that there's a lot going on. Open your eyes and see the writing that is here before us because there's going to be storms. Okay? And when I say storms, I mean situations that's going to hit everybody. Everybody. All right? So you guys, I really wish that this first video coming back would have been more of an upbeat video, but I just can't be upbeat when I see so much devastating things going on around us. And it's sad, you know, it's really sad and it's alarming and it's worrisome, but fear not, just start getting prepared. Time to get prepared, okay? 
So you guys, I want to thank you so much for joining me. For those of you who are sticking by me, still watching these videos, still supporting this channel, I thank you so much. I know it's been a rough time and I haven't been here to really help you guys with your weight loss journeys. I've even, <laughs> I've even backslid a little bit on that. Being in another state, there's so much different types of foods here that I wasn't getting in New York and uh, I've dibbled and dabbled here and there <sighs> okay so throughout the whole entire holiday season it's been a struggle for me okay I'm not even gonna lie it's been a struggle because I've been happy being happy for me means eating and relaxing and enjoying life and that's basically what I've been doing enjoying life you know I'm going to do a life update video for you guys if you want to see that, but I'm going to post that on my other channel. On my other channel. So you guys, I want to thank you so much for joining me, sticking by your girl, for supporting this channel. And for you new subbies, I thank you and welcome you to this channel. There's going to be a different type of flow on this channel because I really want to start talking about more than just making teas making weight loss detox and detoxes and all of that. I want to start talking more about healthy things. Things that is really important in your walk and your journey, all right? And also just, if you want me to start doing reactions, I really want to start doing reactions on some of these other channels that I see that I just want to be able to talk about, okay? And bring, <laughs> and bring some entertainment on this as well and just enlighten you of the things that's going on in the community of YouTube, all right? So until the next time, you guys, stay safe, love your family, and stay focused, all right? Thank you, and I'll see you again in the next video. Are you ready to start your weight loss journey? Because I wanna show you how to kickstart that new you body fast. I have this wonderful detox tonic that will have you feeling and looking better in the skin that you're in. And it's the popular Firm and Flat Belly Detox and Energizer Tonic. This tonic will help you to lose inches, cleanse your blood, burn unwanted body fat. This will also flatten your stomach, remove waste, boost your metabolism, and strengthen your colon. This tonic is powerful, and within four to six hours after taking it, you will definitely have to go. You're going to have a huge bowel movement followed by several more throughout the day. This tonic will remove all of that excess waste stored in your colon, which will have you feeling better with more energy. You can drink two to four tablespoons in the evening before bed, and by the morning, you are going to have to go, 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 all right? You're going to be going to the bathroom. So you repeat taking this straight for one week, and then after that, every other evening to continue removing that toxic waste from your body. Of course, you should eat and drink healthy light meals as well as do some exercise for maximum results. Feel and look better in no time. The Firm and Flat Belly Detox Tonic can be found down below in the eBay store. So hurry and get your bottle while supplies last.